Greetings, Kevin Coyle, John Finley, August 2018 update. Uh, markets are, have almost recovered till their January of 2018 peaks. We're up 7.5% overall in the U.S., and that's led by large cap growth companies again. Uh, tech's up 12% this year, large cap growth companies up over 10. Um, Internationally, the story is not so good, uh, down slightly negative in, in international developed and emerging markets. So a total return portfolio with some international emerging markets, bonds, and some of the tech, then you should be up around 2 to 3% so right. far this year. Um, the earnings backdrop? Earnings are strong. They're still uh, with 8% uh, of the companies reporting over 25% increase in earnings per share. Uh, top line growth is good, year over year over 9% for S&P 500 companies. So a lot of the talk has been, this rally has been for so long, and um, the yield curve is bordering on inverting with the mm -hmm. short term being at two and a quarter percent, the 10 year bond being around 3%. Um, so even though people have been worrying about inflation, the bond market seems to be saying something different. Yeah, we've got the fan of one at, and raising rates uh, because of uh, a fear of overheating economy and, and inflation. Uh, so they're, but they're doing it in a measured way. We expect them to raise two more times to bring the Fed funds rate up around two and a half percent. The investors at the long end of the Treasury curve, however, uh, the reason I think that the yields are still so low is that they're not convinced in the in that continuing growth story or that potential inflation story. Now, whether that leads to a recession remains to be seen. Right. But with the global backdrop and generally the sentiment as well as corporate management seems to be positive as we move going forward. Tariffs? Well, uh, that's the big news item this year, uh, creating a lot of volatility and uncertainty in the markets. Um, although the, the, the stock market so far in the U.S. has been kind of shrugging that off. Uh, the and earnings calls, the, management has been expressing that they felt that the, it's not material right. issue as well as that prices could be passed through. Right. So we'll, we'll yet to be seen, seen there's a lot of uh, saber rattling in the international arena uh, between the Trump administration and these other countries, especially China, which has uh, considerably more to lose in a trade war. Than well, we they do. export 500 billion to us and right. we export 175 right. billion to them. Right. So they would seem to have more skin in the game. Put this all together, cautiously optimistic as we move right. forward. I agree with that. Midterm elections coming up, summer in its last month, it seems like summer is ending in August 1st these days, it's a bit depressing, but it beats sub-zero temperatures until our next update, see you in September, October.